Now, our Just Cooker recipe today is done by Master Chef Newt, <laughs> who is from RQ Restaurant and Snake Bean Diner in Sydney. How are hi, you, mate? Hi, Peter. Nice to meet you. What are you cooking for us? I have no idea. I'll <laughs> 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 uh, make you a very easy, simple um, uh, pak, vegetable pak thai with uh, hockey noodles. Um, you can have vegetable or you put chicken or beef or prawns, anything with it. It's, it's nice and easy. You just put everything together. Just chuck everything in together. And let's get cooking. So yeah, let's cook it. Pad um, thai. Pad I've thai. never cooked this at home before, so okay. I'm you, sure a lot of people haven't. Is you, it hard? It's so simple. As I make, you make yourself sauce. You've got the whole some tamarind puff. Tamarind? Yeah. Now that's easy yeah. to buy these days. Yeah, you get, get, get most, uh, all these ingredients in coals or woolly. Yeah, in um, Asian section. So we've got tamarind. And what was that yeah. you just popped in With there too? Palm sugar. Palm sugar. Now, yeah. why do you use palm sugar instead of normal sugar? Uh, it's palm sugar, more like caramel taste. It's um, like you get that taste from Asian food. Yeah, so it's more texture, more, um, more taste better, I guess. <laughs> And the best way to feed people to, to use it is to break it up, don't they? With yeah. A, you, with you, chop it on the, on the bench and break yeah, it into pieces? You can buy it in a block or you can buy it in the, the one in a jar. In a little bit softer, you can just scoop with the spoon. Okay. Yeah. So you just melt this and then you put a little bit of fish sauce. This, this sauce is, uh, lasts for a long, long time. And you make them, you put it in a jar, tie lid, the jar, and then you keep it in the fridge. And, and next time you want to use it, you just make it again. So instead of making the sauce all the time. So and you make a lot of this, keep it in the fridge, and you've always got the pad thai sauce on yeah. hand for at least a couple of goes. Kids love this stuff, you know, because we make with tomato sauce, you know, kids love tomato sauce. So this, this, this dish is kids' favourite. So we've got the fish sauce, palm sugar, tamarind, tomato sauce. Yeah. Now what have you got in there? You just so popped it's, in some... Um, dried chopped chilli. Okay, dried chilli flakes, beautiful. Yeah, and then you just bring to boil, and that's it, voila. And the pak thai sauce finished. That's it? Yeah. And I can do set, that. Yeah, it's simple. You can do that at home too, that's it's simple. It's very, very easy and simple. Okay, tell me about it. your restaurants as well, because I've been to your first one, RQ, which is in it's Surrey Hills. Yeah, 294 Crown Street. Got that, 294 Crown Street. Now tell me, Snake Bean Diner, I haven't been there yet. What, oh, you haven't been there? Not yet. Okay. It's, What's the difference between the two restaurants? It's, um, it's just, in Snake Bean, it's cheap and cheerful, and um, it's quick and easy, just like a cafe. You just don't go in there, you can get service. You just go in there um, and just quick, very, very quick. Very quick, quick service. And the food, um, I just make it um, cheaper. And um, it's just actually the same style of food because I'm cooking, I'm my type of food, so it's same style of food, and get cheaper. Beautiful. Yeah, so. Now, what are we going to do else here? We've got the beautiful vegetables. Now, you're talking about these hockey noodles. Why are you using these instead? Because usually they're done with um, rice flat noodles. rice noodles, yeah, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, normally Thai, uh, they use a flat uh, rice noodle, and um, I find out when that one reheat next day, because this one, you can cook in a weekend, and the next day you reheat, you take to work, and you reheat, take perfect. Perfect when you reheat. So this is a, this is a really good lunch for people. Really to make the night good. before, yeah. take it to lunch yeah. for your husband yeah. or wife and, and your kids. Or the picnic, yeah, it's beautiful. And you eat it just warm, just just or, or cold actually. Yeah, it's really simple. So that's why I find this texture with hockey noodles is better than okay. rice noodles. Beautiful. Now the stir fry component. Do you need oh. do you need some oil? Yes, I got some oil here. You've got some oil. Okay. It's very easy. So you get this with wok, the flat bottom wok at home. Is it better? See, you don't need to. Well, have, you don't need the um, the walk thing to um, to sit on. Yep. You just get this one from Chinatown, the flat bottom walk. Twenty Much or thirty dollars. Oh, yeah, about uh, fifteen dollars. It's a small one. It's, it's very cheap. Value for money. Mm. And then you just get a walk hard. You do this at home. Really impress you. Impress your all your friends because you just use a walk. There you go. Yeah, there you go. I'll get rid of that for you. And then just check the vegetable in. Straight in? Yeah, straight in. So fried egg, okay. Yeah. Give it a good stir. Yeah, give it a good stir. Now these hockey noodles are already cooked, or they, have they been blanched, or is it straight it, out of the packet? It's already cooked. It's already cooked in the packet. And just... And what else have you got in there? These you got that, uh, some tofu. Fried tofu, is it? Yeah, fried tofu. You just cut it in cubes. 
And that's it. Then just put a little bit of sauce on top. Straight with the sauce. It's like... Now it's smelling good. Look at that. Mm. So you got no garlic or gingers or you, herbs in this? You can put a little bit of garlic in it, but, uh, you know, sometimes there's a flavour like this that tastes good already. So if you want more, if you want the garlic taste, you can fry some garlic to put inside, but this is, tastes good already. This is really yeah. simple. Very, very simple. I'm going to bring your plate over here to serve mm -hmm. it on. There we go. And then you cook for, you cook for about, you don't cook the vegetable, vegetable too much, and you just um, cook for about half, uh, 30 seconds, and you got a little bit of bean sprout. Do you want me to chop some of these oh, up? Oh, please. Yeah, just have a little bit of that. The, um, garlic chive. There we go. You want them in? Thank you. Just a little bit. Yeah, that's fine, thank you. And the and lemon, do you want me to chop that for you as well? Yeah, I can cut the white juice, it's served with that. There we go. And some bean sprout. So the lemon's on there. You got some bean sprouts in there. Yeah. And how do you finish it off? This is finish off with a little bit of that. Peanut. That is a beautiful just cook it recipe. And yeah. I hope. This is so quick, you see how it's just how simple it is, huh? It's very so, simple. Yeah. I reckon that's our, it. our viewers will be dying to yeah. try this and, put everything and cook together. it for their kids for breakfast and for lunch the next day. Newt, and it has been warm it up. fantastic just... having you on the show. Thank you very much and that's it. And, and I look forward to eating at your snake bean diner. Thank you.